breakfast go over my papers today is one of like those days where everything is like jam-packed and I wanted to bring y'all along because this is what it realistically looks like as a PhD student and what I do day to day I planned on not packing my lunch because we have a lab lunch today that I'm really excited about and I also have an exam this week, so I'm going to be working on that while balancing experiments and uh, meetings. So I'll show you guys what that looks like for me, but for the most part, it's going to be a really busy day today. seconds later. Alright y'all, so I just got off the bus and I'm heading to lab. Today I have to split and treat sales. I think when I get in I'm gonna read my paper for a little bit because it's only 929 and then at around 10 or so maybe split some of my cells. So we'll see. And every this is just how my lab and this rotation is doing it. So I'm gonna get myself out of the incubator and see if they're ready to split. I'm only gonna use one plate to split the cells. I think I'm gonna use one that's the most confluent. And then I'm going to save another plate for, treat, for treating them, so yeah. later. Thingy. 
Put it on top. Same thing with this. You need your 10% APS. The only thing that changes, instead of 15 mil, we're doing 20 mil. So you want to follow this. So. Oh, you write sideways? Yeah. So I write it. Must be nice. I write. This is my sloppy handwriting. No way. <laughs> Dude, funny. your sloppy handwriting puts my nice, <laughs> like taking my time, like a minute a letter handwriting. You want to write it here and then you want to transfer it over when yeah. later. Just to make it easier. That's what I do. Cause no, they're always the same value of each other. So, but that, that you get here. So now do, so your tris is 5.0. Because then you have to subtract all the bottom, and that's how you get it. Because that's what she says. Oh. Hey y'all, so 
okay my ear is starting to cut on but today was really crazy like after i did some stuff like where i had to resuspend like my primers in lab i literally had like three back-to-back -back meetings like i had a meeting with my pi i had a meeting with my first year group mentor where we just kind of talked about like rotations and things like that and then right after that i had a leadership meeting at five it's currently six o'clock now this is my phone this is what my phone looks like hopefully it'll adjust let me turn the brightness down but it's six o'clock and um not gonna lie i'm exhausted and i'm hungry and i don't want to work on an exam but i have to work on an exam and i was debating whether or not i wanted to go to the gym what i'm going to do because i have i think i have another meeting i might just push the gym off to tomorrow because i'm just going to try to like give myself free up some time for me today um like for the rest of the week so i won't have to worry about an exam later on this week so just going to give myself that grace or leeway just to kind of you know I get my exams out the way so i don't have to worry about them later on down the road so i'll probably end up going to the gym tomorrow morning and yeah seconds later
I had a semi breakdown because I'm in Panera right now because I'm waiting for like some stuff to get done in Panera's closet. But I had a mini breakdown because I like answered a question wrong and I just like I have so many things going on in my life, like surrounding life. It like I just literally it was just an overflow of emotions and I just like felt like nothing was going right. And I don't know, just every so often you just need to cry and let it all out and release. This is my first cry of my PhD of frustrations. And maybe I was being a little bit dramatic, but that's okay. But uh, yeah, so I'll see you guys in a few. Hey y'all, so it's the next day and I'm feeling a lot better, my, but my face is breaking out. We don't love that, but I'm feeling a lot better. That's the bipolarism of grad school. Um, I came home, I finished my day in the lab, and I need to cook. So today I'm going to make some creamy pesto chicken pasta. And I don't know why I've been craving like pesto a lot lately, but that's what I want to eat. So I'm going to make some chicken. Um do a little bit of work, edit a YouTube video, and I'm gonna try to be in bed by like 9.30. I'm exhausted, y'all, I'm tired. I just, I think I need a good night's sleep. So by 9.30, I'm in the bed, so yeah. But let me change into something a little bit more comfortable. Oh, and I need to fold these clothes, but I'm gonna change into something a little bit more comfortable. Cook, eat, Fold clothes, watch a little bit of TV, go to sleep because my head is hurting too. So, yeah, y'all. So,